which has a proportional relationship between x and i with the ratio of 3 to 5. So your 3 is the first one, which is x. Your 5 is the y. So we look for 5 to 3. A is reversed. B is a possibility. C is 3 to 5. That's correct. So C, we have 3 to 5. So on the second row, 3 times 2 is 6. 5 times 2 is 10. That's correct. 3 times 3 is 9. So 5 times 3 is tw uh, should be 15. That's incorrect. So we're going to come over here. So 3 to 5, is it equal to 6 to 10? So remember to be proportionate. They have to be equivalent ratios, which are also equivalent fractions. So from 3 to 6, we multiply by 2. 5 times 2 is 10, so that is equivalent. The next one is 12 to 20. So we're going to see if we could do 12 to 20, if that's going to fit. And we can come over here and do 6 times 2 is 12. 10 times 2 is 20. So that is also going to fit. And the next one we're going to try is 24 to 40. So again, we look at it and say, well, we know that 12 times 2 is going to be 24. So and 20 times 2 is 40, and that's correct. So all of those are proportionate. B is our answer.